Question 27. A, on the grid, draw the graph of x squared plus y squared equals 4. Now this is the equation of the basic equation of a circle. You've got x squared plus y squared equals the radius squared. Okay, so that 4 is the radius of our circle squared. So the square root of 4 is 2, which means it's a circle where 0 is the centre of it. If the radius is 2, it's going to go through there. It's going to go through there. So 2 naught, naught 2, naught minus 2 naught, sorry, and naught minus 2. So that's where our circle is going to go through. Don't worry if you can't draw a brilliant circle, you're just going to try your best. I won't be able to draw one. So I'm going to just as carefully as possible go round and I mean that's terrible that is but that's okay okay as long as your radius is 2 it's in the middle you'll be fine next question B on the grid sketch the graph of y equals cos x for 0 degrees less than or equal to x which is less than or equal to 360 so basically on the x-axis here it's in degrees it wants us to sketch it from 0 to 360. Now the, the, cos, the cosine curve is similar to the sine curve. Okay. Now the sine curve starts at 0 and it's going to go up, down and then back at 360. It doesn't go above 1, it doesn't go below minus 1. The cosine curve is the same but shuffled along. It starts at 1 there and it goes down at 180 so that's where it meets its uh, minimum value and then it comes back up again to get to the top at 360 it crosses in between these points at 90 so it hits that there and it'll hit the x-axis at 270 okay and then you've just got to try and draw it with a smooth curve there we go and that's it